Hey guys, Blazing Wrath here, and today I'm here to present to you more of my HCS gameplay while well, in the HCS playlist. Here, we're playing Slayer on Regret. I'm still with a few of my teammates. Uh, I don't think a full squad yet, just a couple. Uh, but anyways, so right here, uh, I'm usually pretty good at getting the overshield, so that's what I'm gonna go do. So here we go. Oh boy, here we go. Shit. I barely get it. I barely get the overshield. And now, what I'm gonna do is try and do this jump up. Which I'm normally not good with jump ups in Halo 5. Well, as you can see there. I, like, I had it the second time there, and, and uh, I just fell. So, uh, I probably, like, turned around too early, and that's what probably happened. So, anyways, my, my teammate picks up the plasma caster here, and now we basically got map control, I'm pretty sure. We're 3 to 1 so far, so I'll do, do it pretty good. Putting shots. Uh, holding top mid. Top mid is usually the power position on. Uh, on most maps. This map is a little scary though, I'll be honest. That's why you don't see me hanging out here too often. Because there's, I feel you can easily get shot at and, and regret. Oh, Lexi, right? Uh, I avoid that. Hopefully, just hide. My teammate takes him out. Unfortunately, I get naded by him. Uh, but, anyways, let's see. Alright, my teammate is taking top mid. And I think I had a teammate in red, so I'll, yeah, I spawned red one. So anyways, making my way back up to top mid to the caster spawn. So I just get a different angle and I'm putting shots. Uh, unfortunately, I get taken out by two guys. One guy got me weak and then the last guy got the headshot. Team is pushing in blue one. I spawned red, uh, One of them so died. I spawned here red. Picked up a BR. Nobody wants to pick up a BR. Don't pick up a BR. BR is fucking just stupid shit in, uh, in Halo 5 ever since they ruined it. I have I have negative feelings towards Halo 5's uh, weapon sandbox. Okay, so right here I'm right behind him. I kill one guy, put a few shots on another, and then I'll leave the other one weak at blue uh, blue two. Uh, he gets taken out, and now I'm switching to red. This uh, this map's really easy to uh, control. It's just left and right, left and right, switching back and forth. I think that's one of the reasons. I think it's like from a pro player, from pro professional and competitive players, it's probably their least favorite game type in Slayer. Uh, what am I doing here? Oh, overshield's coming up. I grabbed the overshield. Again, I pro I feel like I should have died the first couple times I get overshield. So, I, I don't know what's going on there. But, I, uh, fortunately, I live and I get the overshield from my team. So, now what I'm going to do is push up, back up top mid and we'll kind of figure out where they're going to spawn. I see one's up here. Throwing a nade. Uh, oh, I get him. Nice. And I'm going to get cleaned up here. Yeah, I'm, I'm cleaned up. But anyways, that's what I was saying about the weapon sandbox in Halo 5. I do not like its current state. Um, I feel like 343 left the weapon sandbox in Halo 5 unfinished. Like, it's just... Like, especially the assault rifle. Like, I... I understand it was overpowered and like... The, or like, a lot of the weapons were overpowered, but it's like... People were asking for, like, subtle changes. We weren't, uh... A lot of people, like, I appreciate the changes they tried to do, but execution-wise, it was just horrible. So now it just ends up, like, a lot of weapons are just useless now, except for precision weapons. Uh, the DMR and my, people seem to have mixed, uh, re uh, feelings on the DMR? I think, uh, in my opinion, it's more of a personal choice. Like, if you're good with the DMR, you go ahead and pick it up. If you're not, if you're not comfortable with the DMR, then, you know, uh, no problem, you can just stick with the Magnum. But the carbine and light rifle are like the definitive like rifles like better than the magnum. Sure. Uh, maybe uh, I I I think some people can also have mixed feelings on the carbine because it's like I think it's got a better TTK slightly, but the uh, problem is is that it's it requires more shots to land, so you gotta be on point. But it it is really good long range. This the uh, it's weird in Halo Five. I don't know why three four three decided to make the carbine a long range laser rifle and it's just like that's the DMR's role. So I don't really understand their philosophy there. And same thing with the doing the weapon t uh, testing. They said like they want the rail gun to be like a long range gun but it's, uh, I don't know about them and uh, but it's uh, I don't know about their thought process but to me it's just like but don't we have the sniper rifle as like the long range gun? So wouldn't you want the railgun to be a close range like one shot gun? Kind of like in Halo 4. I thought in Halo 4 it was fine. But yeah, <laughs> I don't know. But anyways, uh, about to close it out here. We're doing pretty, doing well. I don't think I, I was doing much in this game. 
I mean, the, the least I was trying to do is just put in some shots. You can see I got an assist there. I think my teammates were pretty much destroying this game. Uh, oh, right here. My teammate does a great job thrusting here. Go getting aggressive with the overshield. And as you can see, we're just mopping these guys. Sure, my teammate did a great job mopping the enemy team. I feel like uh, I was more like just putting shots and assisting and the least like whenever you come in this situation, when it, this uh, a little lesson I guess, if you feel like you're not doing much for your team, at the very least the, the thing you can do for your team is stay alive. And oh my god, <laughs> I embarrass that guy. I get the PP kill and that's going to be the end of the game. Uh, but, oh yeah, you can see, I didn't do that great, but the least, if you're, if you're like in fourth place on your team, the least thing you can do is at least get that K, keep that KD up. Uh, yeah, as you can see, I went seven and five. It's not a lot. I got those assists though, but yeah, the, the thing you can do in that situation is just stay alive and, and just put shots. But anyways, that's going to do it for today's video. Um. I stream live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash blazingwrath. You can also follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash blazingwrath. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.